everyone i'm really really excited to share with you about my new gray collection of pearls welcome back to the pearl atelier because this is one instance where i can actually make the necklace to be bespoke for you so this necklace i actually specially commissioned and i wanted purposely for it to be gray in color because it's always been one of my favorite colors and i wanted something that is really really so outstanding so this is sea water pearls in the color gray I always think that the color gray has always been dismissed by people and they usually opt for the classic white pearls. So the gray ones, in my opinion, are actually much more unique because not many people opt for it or maybe they are not aware of it. When I saw this uh, pearl necklace, I immediately fell in love with it because even though it is in the gray category of pearl colors it actually has a tinge of blue to it so this is really really so unique and what i love about this is because of the design i can actually wear it three ways so one way of wearing it is in the classic style you just have the normal necklace around your neck very simple very laid back and then after that and the second way that you can wear it is to have an elongated version of it with the dangly uh, circlet of pearls in the middle of the necklace. And the third way of wearing it is this way with the cluster of pearls in front which is my favorite way. When I saw this design I immediately fell in love with it. And as usual, I always take into consideration which outfit I'm going to be wearing so that I can showcase the necklace. I immediately thought of this necklace. So I actually bought this outfit after I bought the necklace to complement this necklace. And um, I usually don't buy branded items. I think it's a waste of money. I will only purchase them when it's on sale and they have their ways and means of getting these things at a special price. I didn't actually realize that it actually had the Toile de Joy print on it. This is one of my favorite prints because it is made so famous because of the Chatelaine um, Stephanie from uh, Chateau de la Lanne. Because of her, there is a craze for Toile de Joy and I actually think Dior was actually inspired by her because they also came up with a tote bag in this design as well. You can see the model here wearing the same kind of a print and holding the tote bag that is having the same kind of print. For me, I like to keep it very simple, very classic. For this outfit, I've taken my satin grey coloured hairband. I'm really, really excited to see that the Duchess Kate has uh, come back to wearing hairbands again. So I'm sure it's going to uh, take off like like it did before a few years ago i've always been a hairband kind of girl and then obviously to match with my necklace this is actually a 10 millimeter sea water south sea pearls of course as usual having that beautiful beautiful color the south sea pearls are actually the pioneers with coming out pearls with every different hues there is their most exquisite and famous being the golden south sea pearl and uh, this is one exception where i mentioned that you can get gray pearls perhaps in other parts of the world but you cannot get it in this tinge it's really really absolutely gorgeous because even though it is gray in color it has that blue tinge to it so it brings it up a notch so for this one i've taken out my dior lounge suit and then i match it together with my hermes ostrich skin handbag i don't really like to promote brands because it's not as if i buy it all the time i bought this bag many years ago when i was having the boutique and i could get it at a very special price so, so that is exactly why i always invest in jewelry so thank you so much for joining me today i hope that you've enjoyed looking at this new gray pearl collection if you want something bespoke like this you know how to get in touch with me and if you want to know more about pearls i'm going to be linking some videos towards the end so that you can have a look at it at your leisure and i will see you in my next video goodbye